Hey guys, it's Miss Stratton. Um, I just wanted to film a quick video to talk a little bit about that reaction that we observed um, in the baggie and specifically about the masses that we took before and after the reaction. So uh, we know that the law of conservation of mass states that matter cannot be created nor destroyed. And that's the reason why we've been balancing all of those equations and saying, if I start with two atoms of something, I need to end with two atoms of that same thing. Um, and the same is true for uh, the mass being measured in grams. If I start with a total of 50 grams, I should end with a total of 50 grams. If I end with more or less, that means I either uh, created or destroyed material and the law of conservation of mass says that we can't do that. So um, obviously when I took the measurements, uh, we noticed, or hopefully you noticed, that the original measurement and the final measurement were not the same. Um, in fact, the final measurement was a little bit less than the original measurement. So on your lab in question two, it asks if conservation of mass was followed, and it also asks you to explain why or why not uh, it was followed. So um, some things to consider. So first, when those measurements were being made, I was using a triple beam balance, uh, which is a piece of equipment that um, it's not electronic. It is uh, really low tech in terms of measuring mass. Um, so there's that to consider. Uh, there's also the idea that with that low tech um, equipment, there is an increased chance of error. And then finally, especially since we saw the mass go down and we know a gas was produced, um, it is possible that some of that gas may have left the bag. And so if it's not in the bag anymore, and I put it on the triple beam balance, then obviously it's not being accounted for. So again, it was a low tech experiment with low tech equipment. Um, the bags were, you know, hopefully as airtight as possible, but they could not, maybe weren't as airtight as we had hoped. And then of course we also had that low tech equipment. So those are some things to consider when you're addressing question number two. Okay, thanks for listening.